The following PowerPoint presentation will explain in detail the process of reimbursement for professional development activities in the Wyndham School District. To begin with, let's get acquainted with your building reps who are there to help you with any questions you may have. At Goldenbrook School, Bethany Pellerin. At Wyndham Center School, Tracy Lamb. Wyndham Middle School, Katie Smith. And at Wyndham High School, Jill Bartlett. The most important thing to remember is that the pre-approval process for reimbursement is two-pronged. Step one, the first pre-approval needed is the WEA Blue PD reimbursement form signed by your principal. The second pre-approval is the WEA Workshop pre-approval form. This is entered directly in MLP. Here is a look at the two forms for pre-approval that you will need to complete prior to the start of your activity. You will want to save the paper pre-approval form when you receive it back signed by your principal. When you complete your activity, follow these steps. Complete the evaluation form on MLP, mark your activity complete in MLP, and complete step two under reimbursement on the WEA Blue PD pre-approval paper form number one. Please remember to fill out all fields. This is a reminder of the location of step two on your blue form. These are easy instructions on how to submit your packet. Assemble your packet and send to Donna DeZazzo at Wyndham High School clearly marked PD reimbursement. Your packet must include a signed and fully completed WEA Blue PD pre-approval paper form, one copy of your MLP activity request marked complete, a receipt for your requested amount for reimbursement, clearly with a zero balance. And if you are requesting mileage, a round trip MapQuest form with the distance tabulated from your school address to the activity and back. Also, an original certificate of attendance. What happens next? Donna DeZazzo will confirm documents and send your paperwork to Dr. Becht for final approval. At that point, the business office will return all of your materials to you along with your reimbursement check. Congratulations! To end this slideshow, here is two frequently asked questions. Question one, what is considered PD? PD could be workshops, conferences, seminars, in-service training, or a WEA webinar, professional reading, curriculum program development, observation, job embedded activities. Question two, I want to go to a workshop and I do not want to be reimbursed. The answer is, you must enter your activity request to attend this workshop. This is done on MLP only. Complete the WEA workshop reimbursement pre-approval form and do not enter any monetary amount. I hope this slideshow helped you. And again, if you have any questions, please see your building rep. Thank you.